think we're almost there, Ollie. Here we are, and there's the island of Newfoundland. It sure is cold in these waters. I thought islands were supposed to be sunny and warm, with sandy beaches and coconut trees. Not all islands are sunny. This one is close to the Arctic Circle, up near the North Pole. The North Pole? Cool! No, cold! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, the subs will be here soon. I can barely contain my excitement. I see them. <laughs> oh my, stop, stop, stop! Oh, Ollie, slow oh, down. down! I'm gonna win! Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Hey, Walter, it's good to see you. That was some race you were having. Dr. Dr. Kate. Kate! Careful, Scopes! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Metal subs get really cold around here. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's our assignment in Newfoundland, Dr. Kate? We're looking for a Viking ship. Vikings were great sailors and explorers who traveled the Atlantic Ocean over a thousand years ago. That's right. Viking ships were amazing. Some people call them dragon ships because many of them had a dragon head on the front. People think the Vikings traveled and lived here a very long time ago, but no one knows for sure. If we could find a Viking shipwreck in these waters, it would prove that they really were here. Then let's go down and find it. Wait! Hey! Why did you stop me? It's a big ocean down there. We should try to gather more information first. We can gather information while we explore. We can explore after we get more information. I think exploration is the key to discovery. I think information is the key to discovery. <laughs> hold it, hold it. You both make good arguments for your personal styles. So, how about a little friendly competition? Ollie can take Walter down to start exploring. Outstanding idea. Cool! Beth, Scopes, and I will stay here and see what kind of available information we can find. Perfect! Then let the competition begin! Yeah! <laughs> Come on, Walter! We've got a lot of ocean to cover! Oh, yes! Beth's assessment that it's a big ocean is quite accurate, although the Atlantic is not as big as the Pacific. Fish! Yikes! What should I... How should I... Where should I... Oh, dear. Let's go, Walt. We've got a Viking ship to find. Ah! Sonar. Brilliant. Your sonar will help us locate the ship in no time. That's the plan. That sub is truly astounding. Okay, Beth. I'm sending you an overlay map that shows several large, unexplored objects that were picked up on sonar last year. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Scopes. I'm all warmed up now. The objects were found a while ago, so the overlay may be a little fuzzy. No worries. I'll make some adjustments. First, for the current. The flow of water may have moved things around a bit. Now for temperature variation. It was much warmer several months ago. There. Well done, Beth. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Now I wonder which one of these objects might be the Viking ship we're looking for. Your sonar detected anything yet, Ollie? Nope, nothing. Oh! <laughs> nothing but a friendly scooter, that is. Apologies, Ollie. It appears I was a little close. Shh. Did you hear that, Walter? It sounds like the sound of migrating whales. Wow. Huh? I wish Beth could see this. Magnificent. Yeah. Ollie, did you find the shipwreck yet? 
Nope, not yet. Dr. Kate has a map here with information on the location of several large objects. We think one of them might be the shipwreck. We should find it soon. I'll call you when we get there. Not if we get there first. Come on. I've sent you another image, Beth, a route that Vikings may have taken to get here from Greenland. Many believe that the first Viking to arrive was Leif Erikson, and that he set sail on his journey with only 34 men on board his small Viking cargo ship. Like all Viking sailors, he steered his ship by the sun during the day and by the stars at night. That's awesome! Ollie would love that story. Ollie is a pretty terrific submarine, isn't he? He sure is. Something big, like a ship. It's here. It's not a Viking ship. <laughs> Wait, hello there. The name's Sigmund. Hello, Sigmund. I'm Ollie, and this is Walter. You wouldn't happen to be a cousin of Rangers, would you? I surely am. And these are my long fin inshore squidlin, the best looking creatures in the ocean. But do you know what the richest creature in the ocean is? No! What is the richest creature in the ocean? A goldfish, of course! <laughs> <laughs> Your joke was amusing, Sigmund, but we're looking for a Viking shipwreck. Have you seen one? Well, now, I'm not sure if it's Viking, but I do know where an old sunken ship is around here. Yes! Could you take us to it? We'd be totally grateful. Well, sure. Just follow me. I think this site that's closest to the shore is most likely to be the shipwreck, Dr. Kate. I agree, Beth. Beth, we ran to a cousin of Ranger's, and he knows where the shipwreck is. Huh? We'll be there soon. Not if we get there first. Is the shipwreck in this kelp force, Sigmund? On the other side, just go straight on through. Aren't you coming with us? Nope. I'm gonna stay here and let my squidlin' graze a while. But don't worry, you can't miss it. Thanks, Sigmund. Thank you. We're almost there. So are we. We'll be waiting. We'll be waiting first. Come on, Walter. Hurry. Walter? Are you coming? Walter? Walter? Okay, Beth, let's go down and see if we can find that shipwreck. Right. Just let me call Ollie. Hey, Ollie. Dr. Kate and I are going down to the shipwreck now. Okay. Good luck. I gotta go. Ollie, are you okay? I'm okay, but I've lost Walter somewhere here in this kelp forest. Oh, no. He may have gone tangled in the kelp down here. It's very thick. Ollie, is that you? There he is. Gotta go, Beth. Bye. Are you okay? Oh my gosh, yes. Just totally embarrassed. <laughs> you do look a little silly. Let me get you untangled. No, don't waste time, Ollie. You have to get to the shipwreck. I'm not leaving you here tangled up and alone, Walter. But Ollie, Beth will win. It's no big bubbles. But I'll feel terrible if you lose. After we get untangled, we'll race to the finish line. Uh, you really are tangled. Need some help? Yes! Did you find the shipwreck? Not yet. I came to help Ollie get you untangled first. Thanks. I'm glad you're here. Me too. Hello, everyone. Hi, Dr. Kate. There's the ship. Oh, no, you don't. I'm going to get there first. I don't think so. Think again. I won! I found the Viking ship! No, I found it first. I won! I'm afraid neither of you won. Huh? It's not a Viking ship at all. It's a simple fishing boat from the 1800s. A good find, but not the discovery we were hoping for. Aww. But we did make a different important discovery. That it can work to just go out and explore, and it can also work to seek out information first. 
And that's what makes Beth and Ollie such a perfectly astounding team.